Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 6th. But before I get started, I have to uh, I have to address one of my commenters, maybe two. And uh, unfortunately, you all have to see this because you all get to see in the comments this, and you've been seeing it. There's this one commenter that bashes a Leo constantly. And um, I'm not going to give her the gratification of saying her name, but she knows who she is. And she's a Virgo. And she bashes this Leo every chance she gets. And I'm here to tell you that you need help. You need help to release. I have not blocked you yet. But the next time you bash that Leo, you will be blocked. You need counseling. I suggest that you seek it. And I also want to address John, who is one of my, my loyal subscribers as well. I love you, John, and you know who you are. So let's get started. And I don't love him in a romantic way, just so you know. I just love his person. So what do we got for a message today? Kindness. Kindness matters. If you are holding on to animosity, let it go. Let it, you're only hurting yourself. Three of Wands. Now, this is hoping and praying for the best. It's funny because when I picked up these cards, this was the, this, I just did a reading and um, this was the card that stuck out and I thought I'm going to use this and the Three of Wands is going to come up. No kidding. Uh, so this has something to do with a ship of something. Somebody is thinking, they're thinking about uh, a relationship. They're thinking about what, what they're going to do next. Look at that. We have a big old ship up here as well. It must have something to do with a ship. Um, this guy is really thinking. Thinking about going someplace. Thinking about... Um, traveling. This guy is old, very wise. This We have a very wise individual here. Very wise that is getting prepared to do something. Because the two of wands is about the decision. So we are at the three of wands. is thinking about a commitment. The next card is the four of wands. We have a individual that is thinking about a relationship. Thinking about a commitment. Thinking about what he wants. Uh, he's already done something because the decision, he's already made some sort of decision because of the two of wands is already there. We got one more. So he's in the process of making some sort of move. He is. That has to do with a commitment or a relationship. It looks to me as though this ship is coming in. So something is coming in. Something is about to arrive. Okay. Something is about to arrive. Okay, this, we have an individual that has been thinking, thinking a lot. I don't know why it is doing that again. I haven't changed any settings. Oh, yeah. So, getting prepared. Getting prepared to do something. We have an individual that is getting prepared right now. He's in the process of... Uh, 
working it out. He's working it out. He's coming up with a plan of some sort. Three of Swords reversed. Now, the Three of Swords reversed is on the path to recovery. Healing, forgiveness, looking for forgiveness, hoping for forgiveness, because this is hoping. It is. Three of Swords is forgiveness. Time to leave the past hurts and the past heartache behind. This is releasing pain and moving forward. So somebody is going to be releasing pain and moving forward. This is heartache, grieving. There's been some sort of painful separation. Or there's been some heart problems or something like that. This is a card of healing, making the decision, okay? Because this is somebody who is in the process of making a decision. So we have an individual that is in the process of making a decision to leave the past hurts behind, okay? Um, and move forward, okay? And this does have to do with a relationship because the next card is the Four of Wands. Um, page of Wands. Now, some sort of news is going to be coming. This does, this is good news. Uh, we have an individual that may have been distracted. They were distracted for a minute, but something positive is coming in. There could be a new suitor here with the page of page of wands. This is with you have you have this you know the page of wands is a new suitor or a new opportunity that you have a lot in common with. Okay, so there could be a new suitor coming in that you have a lot in common with. Okay, and this could be bursting into your life. It just it just shows up. Okay, it just shows up. Um, this is also something coming to fruition, perhaps that you started a long time ago. Now it's coming to fruition. Now this can also be a need for new things. So we, ha I think we have an individual that is in the process of showing up okay they're showing up they've been thinking about it they've been in a painful situation in the past now they're they are definitely uh getting excited they're 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 wanting a new adventure they may be ready they're ready this is a new suitor it is this is good news it may have something to do with three years ago Something that you started three years ago, maybe um, coming to fruition or coming back around. And I don't know if that's the case for everybody. But this is, this is a new opportunity. It really is. And it's exciting. And there's opportunity for growth here. And it will help you to heal. Okay, this is, this is healing. It is healing. Page of Coins reverse. Now, somebody definitely got distracted. They went down the wrong path. And that going down that wrong path caused them some heartache. But this is a dead end. Somebody went down to a dead end. They went down a dead end road. They may have gotten themselves involved with somebody that wasn't very committed they may have been foolish. No, no, nothing long term. Somebody went down uh, the wrong path and it caused them a lot of pain. They may have been dealing with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn, you know, that hurt them. And now there's another opportunity. There's another opportunity with somebody that is better suited. It doesn't have to be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be anybody. But we have somebody that went down the wrong path with an individual that wasn't well suited for them. And now they have another suitor that is, is like coming out of nowhere. It's like all of a sudden. I feel like it is definitely all of a sudden. Ah, the lover's reverse. Now the lover's reverse is a choice. 
It is a choice. Somebody made the wrong choice. Okay, they did. They made the wrong choice. And there's been a lot of disharmony. But now, and there's been, there was somebody went into a, like a one-sided situation where the other person just wasn't interested. Lazy, perhaps. Just didn't put in enough effort. But anyway, now we have a separation. We have separation here and separation here. Or there's been a separation from the wrong one. Okay? Wasn't meant to be. There's somebody new here as well that is, is that is arriving. They're coming. It's a better suitor. It really, really, really is. Now this could be a contract. It doesn't have to be a love affair, but I or a lover or whatever. This is a contract. Somebody has severed ties or ended a contract that didn't that wasn't meant to be. Something better is coming. That that is better suited. That it will grow. This did not work out because it just there was a lack of in interest. There was. Whatever road they went down, there was, um, it was unstable probably from the beginning. Queen of Swords. Now, the Queen of Swords is very, very smart. Somebody's going to have to think fast. Okay, this person has to think fast. Very honest, very authentic, very truthful, very intuitive, very smart. Can't pull the wool over this person's eyes. This is a professional. Okay, this is somebody that is uh, a very intelligent, the Queen of Swords. This is getting a new perspective, seeing the truth, you know. Feels like we could be dealing with a Virgo here. We could be dealing with a Virgo who is seeing something, taking a new approach. And this is this. I don't know why I think it's a Virgo. It doesn't have to be a Virgo, but I think this is the Virgo uh, symbol. See. It could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius as well. Somebody went down the wrong path. They didn't they they just didn't think before they did so. Or they they tried. They tried, right? And then there's some sort of pain here. This person knows the truth, speaks the truth, is very authentic, is very very wise. Somebody is seeing the truth and they are going to be communicating. This is a communicator. Communicates very well. There's good news arriving, seriously, good news arriving for this person. This person is going to have to really uh, use discernment as well because she is very discerning. Five of coins reversed. Now, this has to do with the separation. They were going to see an improvement. Somebody got themselves in an unhealthy relationship and they had a major loss. Now we are going to see a turning point. We are. We're going to see a turning point. This is a turning point. This is, this is a separation from the wrong one. And I feel like it's a coming together with the right one. There's something better coming in that is better suited. But this five of coins reversed is giving up. It's it's the end of a difficulty. It's it is. It's the end of difficulty. It's it's uh, coming out. It's coming out of the darkness. It really is. It's seeing the truth. It's it's coming out of feeling like a victim. It's fe of being a victim. It's really, you know, uh, 
separating, separating from that victim mentality and uh, coming in of some sort. It's like a coming in, coming into the light, coming in and, and speaking up. Somebody's going to be speaking up. I feel like this person has been reluctant to speak up. Maybe they made a foolish, but this is fool, maybe they made a foolish mistake, went down a wrong path. It could be, you know, worried that they'll be rejected or something like that. Um, the Queen of Swords is very um, hard to, uh, you can't play games with her. Okay, the Queen, you don't play great games with the Queen of Swords. You don't. She don't play games. So, anyhow. Um, six of Cups, somebody from the past. There is gonna, there is somebody from the past that is that is, is about to come in. This is somebody from the past that is about to come in. You knew this person in the past or some you met this person somewhere. Could be three years ago, could be from your childhood. There's definitely some sort of connection here. I feel as though this person has separated from the wrong one. They may have, you know, not communicated with you. They may, you may have felt um, abandoned. We may be dealing with a Taurus here. This person has been watching. They've been watching, but, but they haven't been able to communicate because they felt like they couldn't for some reason. They felt that they, maybe they felt ashamed. Maybe they were embarrassed. They were embarrassed because um, they didn't know their value or they didn't have enough to offer. Or they didn't think they had enough to offer or they were embarrassed that they went down that path or something like that. But now we have a separation and somebody uh, coming in. This person has definitely been thinking about it. They've been thinking about the reunion. And they're definitely probably going to, I think, definitely, probably, I mean, those are two different answers. I think they're going to communicate. This is communication. This person has been waiting for communication. The Queen of Swords, she she's very smart and intelligent, okay? She usually waits for the communication. She's very observant, okay? Smart, very smart. She knows, too. She knows something. And this person is coming, absolutely, the Knight of, the Knight of Swords. This is a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. This is direct, honest communication coming in. There's, this person may be very chatty when they start to talk. Okay, they're going to really, really open up. Whoever you're dealing with is very sharp themselves. Very smart. This person, when they come in, they're going to come in hard and they're going to come in fast. Okay, they're going to be on a mission. This is a man on a mission. Looks like he makes a decision and he does it. And he has no fear. He's fearless. So this is a fearless individual coming in fast. He's a protector of some sort. Uh, <laughs> he may wear a helmet. He may wear a helmet. There's a helmet here. Um, interesting. Now, this is a badge as well. So there could be somebody coming in that has a badge. This is a protector. I don't know where that's coming from. And this has to do with children. So we're changing the story a little bit here. So we do have, for I don't know, this is for somebody else. There could be a protector that's coming in for some children. This is a professional. I know I'm changing the story, but some, but there could be, you know, a professional uh, individual that is coming in to protect some sort of children. There's been some sort of abandonment and neglect. This person isn't very healthy. So just saying that's another some that's for somebody else. This person has been definitely been observing. They've been watching. Somebody's been being watched.
two of cups two of cups now this is a union take a look at that this is a union with somebody that you have a deep connection with and i think that you've met this person before this is a union it is this is this is two people that see eye to eye they have very 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 much in common uh, something to do with water may they may I don't know what it is but it has to do with water you you may have met this person uh, this, that's coming up from the water something to do with the water um, which is interesting this is a perfect 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 match you may have held this person's hand before these are two people that see eye to eye coming together that's for sure we have two people coming together that are meant to be after there's a separation from the wrong one this person is going to communicate they are going to communicate the communication is coming there's been some sort of neglect or abandonment or something like that I feel like there's a reunion here, some sort of reconnection with somebody that you are. It's a soulmate connection. It is definitely a soulmate connection. Somebody has been waiting, waiting and reading and waiting and waiting and waiting for this person to come. This person is going to, they are going to communicate. They've been in a painful situation that they have probably now separated from. They probably know that they're going to be asked all kinds of questions because this person asks all kinds of questions. Kind of like, what took you so long? Anyhow, I do believe that there is going to be, and you got to remember that I'm going to get people that say, I don't want to connect with the past. I don't want to connect with my ex, but I know a lot of people in my past that, you know, they're in my past. It's not my ex. You got to be open. And this is open-minded. She is very open-minded. Be open-minded. Be open-minded. Okay? Listen to this person. Listen. Somebody is going to be communicating that you connected with maybe and it doesn't mean that you even I don't even see you know you may not have even had any kind of uh, sexual relations with this person before you may have held their hand you know but you know it doesn't mean that you've been with them I do feel like like this is a um, Reunion between two people that are absolutely meant to be together. Let's get one of these. Where are we at? These two people see eye to eye. They have so much in common. this yesterday so this is manifested somebody has manifested this and they have shed the old that they have and they're bringing in somebody new it's what they've asked for this is a divine connection it's a this is somebody that is very self-aware that is going to take action there is going to be some communication that is coming in absolutely from an individual that is determined very, very, very determined. Let's get one more. Patience. It's time. It's time. 
after the ending is the renewal, the recon the the reconciliation, whatever. There it's time. It's time. Somebody is about to get what they asked for because they take action to move forward. So I would say that you can expect to receive some sort of communication with somebody that you may have passed up or they passed up on you. That's what I think this is. Good luck.